This daily looks horrible, dude. Let's do it. Dramatic entrance is good. Enlightenment is also good. So like vintage is interesting, but terminal is uh it's real bad. Since normal enemies don't drop cards, I'm not really sure what to do here. I guess we'll take this left path. We do get plated armor for free, which is good, I guess. Okay, Paper Frog's actually a really good starting relic. So far, it's not that bad. But like, wait, what? I should read the patch notes. Meat on the bones also pretty good. Oh, actually, Dreamcatcher could be great. Alright, so never mind elites, we're gonna look for campfires instead. Although, you know, I should still do elites because they give points. But I'd like to just win as well. Just strange status. It's gonna make slimes a lot more annoying to deal with. Plated armor at Wary Kalkin. It's really good. I don't know if I can afford to do two elites right now. Let's just go for the win. You can still remove curses, right? I'll go for the plus five max HP though. We're gonna have plenty of relics. I went for upgrade enlightenment there because it's interesting mostly. Oh, I was supposed to rest because that's how Dreamcatcher works. I didn't realize it was only when you rest.
Frozen egg's okay. I should definitely have gone the way with the uh, elite then. This is a really good run defensively. Juicy bracelet's pretty good. Art of War is really bad. Alright, this should be fine. This guy is no big deal. Especially with uh, plated armor and where you kill him. Should be no problem at all. We actually get cards from elites, which is a bonus. A lot of these are great though. Go Sever Soul. Unlikely to ever use a dex potion. Toolbox is great also. Strawberries, honestly, okay, since we're losing HP. So we can either rest to try to add a card or we can upgrade something. Grading Rampage could be fun. basically makes it twice as good. Ooh. We get the chance we can always sever soul out our defense as well. I need to play this every time I draw it. Should have defended first, I guess, but our HP really doesn't matter in this fight. Since we heal anyway at the start of the next floor. Kuna is not very good for us. I kind of like the mix of potions we have. I mean, brutality is usually fine. Pandora's box transform all strikes and defense. You want to have fun this run? I 
All right. Uh. It's definitely interesting. Perfected Strike is pretty much a dead card. We do have another Rampage, though. Probably want to remove the Body Slam and maybe the Perfected Strike. Other than that, it's pretty good. So looking at this... We can easily go for two elites. Leaning towards this side. Oh gosh. Use brutality. Use enlightenment. It's still eight for one. It's the same as a strike. That's not that bad. Alright, so... Probably should have played a Rampage. Yeah, pair. It's fine. We do want that. This... Oh, this feels bad not to uh, draw into enlightenment. Okay, bash first. Barra is great. Choose a skill from your draw pile. Rampage Headbutt is a really good combo. I like it a lot. Guru Doll is actually... It incentivizes curses quite a lot. If I play that, I can't play Carnage. I think we're fine with losing Carnage this time, though. So they can play Clash and Headbutt. Anchor is pretty good. Really wants us to have double fire potions.
Yeah, take Thunderclap. Although, to be fair, actually we shouldn't have taken Thunderclap because usually Bash already only costs one. Decent. Again, Thunderclap probably shouldn't be in our deck, but... Definitely want to remove Body Slam first. As for the rest of these, we don't need them. Nothing here is very... Gremlin Horn is okay. What's our boss? Okay, well, Ancient Tea set's great. So Inflame will actually already be upgraded because of Frozen Egg. So I think that's fine to take. It's also a power, so it won't be around forever. Easy. Okay, skills will already be upgraded. That's good. I'm not even sure what I would want to add to the deck at this point. It's uh, flowing decently well already. Easy. Do we want to always draw one of our skills? 
I mean, Babble Trance maybe. Also, Enlightenment would be good. But probably Babble Trance. Shuriken is great. Bottled Flame. We could use it to grab Sever Soul, but we don't really have skills that we want to exhaust anyway. Dual Yield could be good. I definitely think we take Shuriken, and we probably just remove a card. I'm leaning towards Perfected Strike. In fact, that's the easy remove, I think. I think upgrading Babel Trance is probably the right play. Carnage does gain a lot of damage. Since we just made Battle Transinate, drawing an extra card is great. Do we want to exhaust anything in our hand right now? Not really. We can play everything as well. We want to exhaust this. We can lose Carnage here. Rampage is doing enough. Alright. This is a good run. So actually I think Demon Form is great in our deck. Still don't think uh, three relics are worth three curses even with Duvudol. So this is easily worth the time blue. Alright. Get to Elites. Alright, that's good. We'll do that. And this is why I think Demon Form is so good in this deck. Pen is a good, uh, it's a good relic. I don't think upgrading is worth potentially a curse at this point. Oh, bag of marbles is so good.
bag of preparation is so good. Molten egg, pretty good. This guy should be no problem. Probably go for Carnage. We have Pendip ready. Unfortunately, he is intangible this turn. Severusol is almost worth to get rid of Burns, but wasting Pendip this turn wouldn't be good. We have to just pass. Okay, so Heavy Blade is insane in our deck, and that's already upgraded, so easy take. Very easy take, in my opinion. I shouldn't have used that actually. Or no, I must have had block already. Never mind. It did exactly 150 for you. Insane. What you get? Nah, these aren't worth. Seeing red, maybe, but I don't think so. Definitely not worth. We'll go for the other elite still, even though it's not going great. Transform a card. I know there's at least one card in here that was not good. I don't remember what it was though. I guess probably Sever Soul is the weakest at the moment. Oh my god, it, we got flex. What? <laughs> if 
That's so crazy. Um, we could take Whirlwind. Is there anything we want to remove? Thunderclap, maybe? Do I add Whirlwind? I don't think so. Although we do have a lot of energy on turn one. I don't think I add Whirlwind. Could go for the Inflame. But since we have a uh, demon form, I don't know if it's necessary. I don't think I want anything here. What's left before the boss? Another shop. Okay. Can remove another card. Dramatic entrance is tempting to drop. Or the second not upgraded rampage. Or drop kick. Oh, dude, do we buy back the dropkick? <laughs> At this point, I don't think there's actually anything else I'm going to get rid of. Like, maybe Dramatic Entrance, but Exhaust's first turn anyway for free, so... Not much points. Uh, we could get rid of Clash, maybe, but it's just a free card. I don't think we do anything in that shop. Upgrade the last rampage. All right. Decent turn one draw. Okay. Hit enlightenment. That's good. Um. Oh no, that was... Oh, I wasn't watching the counter. That wasn't good. That's okay though. It's already doing 208. I don't want him to reset this turn, do I? Can I kill him? Wow. It was a fun day there. It went a lot better than I thought considering we dropped down to 57 HP by the end. Twenty-five plus relics. Defeat an elite without taking damage. Looks like this one stacks twenty-five each. Nice. Not bad. We could have gone for a really thick deck for a better score, but hey, it wasn't the kind of daily for that, I think. Wow, this guy. That's pretty insane. 
if it's even real. Well, anyway, thank you for watching.